Hello. How are you? Oh, good. How are you? Good, good, good. How's she doing? You know, it's, um, she's declining. Hi. So oh. where's the peanut butter? You get the peanut butter? I've lost family members and the things that we've done for them towards their end of life, it's like, why aren't we doing this for rugby? If we only have her for a few more months, we should make her comfortable. Boy, good. Now you look more cozy on your bed. We have a 13 and a half year old Newfoundland. And as she was aging, our vet kept recommending acupuncture as a way to alleviate some of the pain to make her mobility better. And we also thought that this is something that we should do for her for her end of care. But she can always call me too. If Thank you, yeah. As an end of life care veterinarian, we consider our patient to be not only the pet, but also the owner or the caregiver. Lift her up or notice when she's struggling. We have more time to offer to clients to help them make decisions and talk about the problems that they're having with their pet. And that's what people need is to be able to have the time to talk to a doctor. Helping owners through the emotional part of losing a pet is very difficult, but it's something that's part of an end-of-life care veterinarian's job to support them and, and help them know they're making the right decision for their pet. So I've been carrying up and down the stairs, but it's like a lot. He's 70 pounds. Yeah, it's crushing me. The most common concern I see with people is that they do not want their pet to suffer and they want my help to figure out when their pet has crossed that line. We're starting to see more and more practices open up that really focus in on end of life care with hospice care and, and palliative care. Since this is such a growing field, there's more and more options for owners to have. Some of the responses I've gotten from owners have been amazing. They are so thankful that they had someone to help guide them through this part of their pet's life. I find it a really like an honor to be there for them at this making this really important decision.